What's going on guys, it's Risky here, welcome back to another Call of the Wild video on my channel here today, and in today's video, I'm going to be going over all of the new species of animals that are coming with this new map, Parque Fernando, I still think I'm saying that wrong man, Parque Fernando, I don't know, but anyways, I'm going to be going over all of them as best as I can, and just showing you guys all the names, and all, not really a description of them, just basically showing you them, and telling you what they are, and uh, just saying my opinion on them. So, if you guys do go and enjoy this video and find it useful, please be sure to hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and if you do want to enter in the giveaway, please be sure to go to my giveaway video and see how to enter. Uh, that'll be There'll be a link to that in the description, and also a link to this trailer. If you have not seen it yourself, you can go and watch it yourself by hitting the link in the description. And uh, without further ado, let's get straight into this. Okay, so the first two animals it shows us here in the trailer are the beautiful Axis Deer. I don't think we've had these yet. No, we haven't actually. Uh, these things are awesome looking. Uh, I'm assuming that one right there is not even the biggest, that buck right there. I'm assuming, or stag, I don't even know if they're called a buck or a stag. Uh, but I'm assuming that's not the biggest one. I'm assuming that's like a level 1 or level 2. I don't know if they go to level 9 or level 5 or anything. We'll have to figure that out once we get our hands on. And it also shows us these beautiful Lubin Meadow, Loop lupin meadows sorry and uh in this scene it shows us the beautiful black spiral bucks i'm pretty sure the spiral black bucks or something like that a oh, spiral horn black bucks i'm pretty sure is what the actual name is uh but very beautiful creatures very very beautiful and um i, I don't know man this is looks like the scene of the postcard that we've seen in uh Layton lake and all those other maps that i showed you guys um, it, it, they just look so cool. It, it's a beautiful map. You guys, I'm so excited for this DLC. But let's get on to the next animal. Alright, so the third animal it shows us in the trailer is the beautiful mule deer. Just look how beautiful they are. I love mule deer in real life. I think they're awesome deer. Unfortunately, in Florida, we don't have them, so I can't hunt them. But one day, I would love to kill a mule deer. These things are awesome, and I am a huge fan of these type of animals. Uh, and I'm very excited to... Uh, you know lay one out next up we have some type of duck which i will show you in just a second but i'm going to play the actual clip from the trailer because i have no idea how this lady pronounces them but i will say that these are some beautiful looking animals or birds and i am very excited to uh, see what other equipment that we get to um hunt these things if we do and maybe we'll just have to use the regular stuff that we got with duck and cover i don't know but just they're very beautiful looking ducks and um yeah, I'm going to play the clip now just so you guys can actually uh, hear how it's pronounced because I have no idea how to pronounce it. Will you come find flocks of brightly bloomed cinnamon tea? The next animal that we have shown to us in the trailer is the red deer. We are all familiar with the red deer, especially from Hirschfelden, and I am very excited to see these guys come back on another map uh, because they're fun to hunt on Hirschfelden, but if you have another map to hunt upon, that makes it way better. And I am a huge fan of red deer. I've been chasing after a diamond lately. Uh, well, not lately, but w I don't know. I've been playing a lot of Rahong guys, you can tell, going after the Gimsbach, but once I'm done doing that, uh, we'll probably be going after some red deer on this map because I really want to get a diamond red deer I think these creatures are awesome, but there you go. That is awesome that we're getting them on uh, Parque Fernando The next and final animal well not the final but the final one it talks about in the trailer is the puma This is one that I am excited about and a lot of people are excited about everyone has been wanting coyotes wool well, well not coyotes wolves sorry uh, Pumas mountain lions and all that good stuff and boom, we finally got Pumas. I am, I, I don't know, this is going to be awesome. Just to be running around the map, knowing that you got to be careful of where you're stepping and what territory you're in, or you're going to get clawed by a freaking, uh, excuse me, a Puma, that is awesome. These things look beautiful, and I think they're going to be very awesome, especially if we get a trophy lodge to hang these dudes up in. Oh boy, that'll be crazy. So, there you go. There's the Pumas. Uh, let me know if you guys are excited for them, because I know I am. The final animal it shows off in the trailer is the Cape Buffalo. We all know the Cape Buffalo from Verhanga, so that's pretty cool to see them getting uh, another chance at another map. Uh, so, there you go. I think these guys fit this map pretty well. They look beautiful out there in that beautiful green grass. Uh, Expansive Worlds does amazing with their trailers. I am very blown away when I see this trailer. They, their cinematics and everything is just absolutely 
ridiculous and I don't know let me know if you guys are excited for this map because I know I am and uh, yeah I'll keep you guys updated on any more information that I get on it and any of the new animals and stuff don't worry your boy risky will keep you updated that's what I love doing for you guys these are fun videos to make and I enjoy I enjoy being updated on things like for other games that I play besides under call the wild and I see a lot of people making update and news videos for like GTA and Red Dead and Call of Duty and stuff and no one really does it for Call of the Wild and uh, so I like doing it for you guys and um, I don't know these videos do really well and I appreciate all the support on them and uh, yeah let me know what your guys thoughts are on Parquet Fernando and all the animals coming to it and until next time guys it's been Risky and I'll see you in the next one later